Hello everyone and welcome to Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. My name is Melanie B. Okay, here we are at Kano Shrine. Okay, let's go check this out. So I've been in here once before, but I'm not exactly sure what this shrine is about. The power of electricity. Okay. So what are these things? Okay, so I need to power this. This thing back here, like this one. So that should be easy enough. Okay, it surely can't be that easy. <laughs> What's up here? Okay, it's locked. Okay, this side has electricity. This one does not. Okay, what's down there? Okay, nothing. There's a ladder to get back up though. Okay, let's check the other side instead. Oh dear god. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, so there's a baddie. Um, yeah. Okay. Super easy though. Okay. And it got an ancient screw and an ancient spring. Oh, there's the power thingy. Um... Okay, but it's attached. Um... So I have to get it... <laughs> Okay, let's try an arrow. Okay, that broke it free. Okay, so now the block is out of the way. So the key must be over here someplace. And there is a treasure. Okay, cool. Okay, is there another treasure chest someplace? Huh? 
Okay, maybe there isn't another treasure. Oh, geez, another one. <laughs> this one is bigger. Okay, um... And he can reach see me all the way from here. Okay, I'll just go up. Hand to hand combat, except with a weapon. Okay, got ancient gear, ancient screw, and a guardian sword, which I need. Okay, um... Yeah, we'll get rid of this one. Okay, so this side is powered, this side is not. Okay, I don't want to be electrocuted, so I better not get in that water. Place that one there. So we just got to get them connected. Okay, they're connected. There is a treasure. Haha, you thought you could hide, but you cannot. Okay, a uh, Girondo Scimitar. to get rid of something else okay oh I don't want to part with anything I can guess I can get rid of this or not you stay there Grab my arrow back that I attempted to waste. Your resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. 
this is orb number two. Kinda wish all the shrines was this easy. Okay, where to now? Now, last time I said I was going to go to Baruta, but the truth is that was a lie. I'm not going to go to Baruta, and hear me out on this. Um, I'm afraid of Baruta. I don't know why. I find it very intimidating. I find that dungeons are hard, and that one looked hard, so... I'm gonna avoid it for a little bit longer. Okay, so I wanted to go to find Hestu, and I guess he's gone to the to the Kirk Forest, um, which is in the north someplace, in this region up here that I haven't unlocked, I guess. So we'll have to unlock more of that region. I don't want to go to the central tower because I know that's super hard. So I think I will go along this path down here. I also needed to find this memory, but the last one I received was this one. So this one should be close by. So maybe we'll find it on our way out here. Okay, is there any- oh, I can already see it in the distance. The Gerondo Desert Getaway- oh, Gateway. Okay, there's a Traveler. Oh, there's a couple of people out here. Gartan? They sure make these Gerondo ladies tall, don't they? What a bunch of buttes. Now if they just let me move into Gerondo town. <laughs> the Emporium is open. Come one, come all. All the little bits and bobs you need to spice up your dishes. Oh. What have you got? Uh, it's got arrows. Um, I'll take those. Okay, he doesn't really have anything particularly <laughs> useful otherwise. Okay, thanks. Ah. Sabota. Kalissa Sabota. Mm -hmm. If you're searching for Kalissa, legendary treasure hunter, then your search is over. You're looking at her. Ah. I've been in the game for over 20 years. When I set my sights on a treasure, you can be sure that I'll claim it. She certainly is very tall. Now, is there a tower around here? Okay, there's like so much going on that I want to go see. <laughs> But let's try to get to this memory first. Now uh, there's palm trees over there, so it's some sort of oasis. Uh, 
Hopefully there's no baddies over here. Another one of the tall, beautiful women. Oh dear. Oh gosh. Is this another dungeon? Is another divine beast? Oh my goodness. It's a camel. This is scarier than Baruta is. God, I'm like literally just shaking right now. I know this is just a game, but it's a scary game right now. Hmm. Uh, Lucan, you look like your everyday traveler, but how can I be sure? Don't tell you what, oh. but I'm no merchant. I'm Gerardo Town Soldier in disguise. Oh. Ever heard of Yiga Clan? They are a group of thieving bandits who have caused all sorts of trouble back in town. I got a tip that some of them go incognito as travelers to ambush the unwary. That's why I'm dressed as a simple merchant. My mission is to blend in and stay on guard in case they strike. They were bold enough to strike at Geronda Town, so I wouldn't be shocked if they struck at travelers too. Yeah, they certainly have. Okay, I don't know what to do right now. Did that scene just trigger because I am so close to the town? Or is this like divine bees close by? Okay, there's a tower up there. But let's try to get to the memory. Karakara Bazaar. This is Rep. This is Karakara Bazaar. Gerardo Town is still a fear distance southwest of here. If you're headed there, you should consider resting a bit. Though you are a bow, even if you make it to town, you won't be able to get in. All the same, the Divine Beast is kicking up a storm right now, so I don't recommend going to Gerardo Town. Okay, let's ask about Gerondo Town. Oh. It's not Gerondo, it's Gerudo. Gerudo Town. Is to the southwest. It's the biggest town in the area. It's famous for trade and also for staying active and vibrant all night long. However, there is a law forbidding Bo males from entering the city. Okay. Divine Beast. Mm -hmm. You don't know about Divine Beast Vanaboris? Supposedly, it is the guardian deity for the Gerudo people, but it suddenly started acting up a while back. There's nothing we can do to stop it either. It's protected by a fierce sandstorm and intense lightning. Though it hasn't yet, it could easily head towards Gerudo Town or this oasis. I do my best to keep an eye on it from here. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Ha, I don't need any thanks. This is my job after all. You know, the desert is hot during the day and cold at night. It'll take the energy out of you in no time. If you plan to head out into the desert, make sure you're prepared. Okay. Now, so I know there's a special cooling potion. So we might need that. Oh, here's the memory.
Okay, Link always the hero. Running in to save Princess Zelda. She totally runs like a girl. <laughs> but I guess she's female, so that makes sense. <laughs> oh, Gartan again. Okay, I don't need to talk to you. What else is around here? Okay, seared steak. I don't need that. Anything in the water? Okay, I can buy some hydromelons. And some coconuts and bananas. Can I? I can cook here. Okay, I might have to do that. Who's this person? Oh. Robston? Hey. Oh. Um, you're a traveler. Oh. oh, I see. Well, we're merchants. Who's we? We wanted to make it to Gerudo Town to sell our goods, but we were stopped before we could go in. Oh, there's a shrine over there, too. They only let women into that town, and to think we came all the way out here. Our leader went to Gerudo Town to try to figure out how we can get inside. Mm. But he hasn't come back yet. I imagine he's having a, having a ton of luck. He isn't having a ton of luck. Okay. And there's someone else. Hey, stop running. You. Guy, stop. Oh my gosh, stop. Oh, it's just Gartan again. Okay, so there is a tower over there. And I assume that's gonna unlock this region. Which I kinda wanna do. But uh, let me finish seeing what's available here. Oh, beetles over here. Who's this? Zavak. The Bronson? Who are you? Uh, oh, gotta go? Let's say, uh... Huh? You, you're a boat, aren't you? I am... Why? Mm. Hmm, no. I bet Mama would have a problem with a delicate bow like you. Mm. Oh yes, I'm Ronson. I hail from Gerudo Town. Oh. This search for love of my life, I'm so exhausted by it. Uh, I don't know why I'm even saying this. It's no business of a Hylian like you, but I'm constantly being bothered by my mother over not having found the love of my life. Why the rush? Mm? You don't know? Really? It's incredibly rare for a male to be born to the Gerudo town. For our town, it's incredibly rare for a male to be born to the Gerudo. For our own survival as a people, we travel to find husbands. I've proven myself to be a gifted tailor. But none of the bow I've met seem to appreciate a well-helmed garment. I was hoping my craft would help me find a mate, but it doesn't seem like there's much work for a tailor around here. I wonder if there really is someone out there for me. Aw, I'm sure there is. Poor Ronson. And who's this? Ew. Guy? <laughs> I'll play as Guy. Nice. Hello there. But before I say any more, have we met before? I came here from Rito Village. Where is that? Oh. Yes, Rito Village. Far to the north of here, it's a modest village on the Tabatha frontier. I had a great plan, you know. I left Rito Village to try to earn some money out in the world. 
but it's so incredibly hot here during the day, it's been tough to work up the will to go any further. I would like to see what Gerudo Town looks like, even if I can't go inside. It's just so hot. I heard there's an elixir that can help beat the heat. It's made from insects with cooling effect and monster parts. Uh. But they don't seem to be selling the elixirs anywhere. I've heard insects with these cooling effects live in the cold parts of the Gerudo Highlands. But, mm. well, the monsters here are rough, to say the least, so I'm not having a lot of success getting myself motivated. Okay, an ice guy. Okay, so... What is his quest? A guy of the Kara Kara Bazaar needs a cooling elixir to beat the heat. Okay. Okay, I saw a beetle. And there... There's a Goron here as well. Straight, I'm watching the sandstorm. Wanna join me? What sandstorm? Sandstorms are pretty common out in the desert. If you get caught in one, you'll get lost for sure. But I hear the sandstorms over there will die down for a few hours each day, clearing a path. I want to visit that huge tower, but the sandstorm is in the way, so I'll just sit here and wait for it to die down. Okay. <sighs> Okay, he wants my bladed rhino beetle. Beetle loves bladed rhino beetles. Would you consider giving it to me? A mighty elixir. Sorry, but no. I'm not giving you any more of my beetles. Oh, and I here I thought I knew what kind of a person you were. No, it's fine. Beetle just isn't a very good judge of characters, apparently. <laughs> Anyway, back to business. <laughs> okay, what have you got? <laughs> so we can buy some arrows. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> and we can buy the summer wing butterfly. A cold darter. Let's get that. Okay, yeah. <laughs> okay, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and mix up some elixirs. And then I want to head over to this tower. I don't think I want to go to Gerudo Town just yet. But I think that's gonna be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.